couple. Oh my gosh, hello to all the uni couples out there. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are so amazing, guys. <laughs> 1,000 subscribers! Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's so amazing! Terima kasih! Sudah subscribe Thank you so kita. much! Terima kasih! 1,000 <laughs> subscribers! Finally. Oh my gosh, it's so amazing! <laughs> and it's just crazy to see how much engagement we have had in the last couple of days. I think it's because ah, of yeah. the baby. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as you know that we have, we're gonna have a baby, everybody like starts subscribing. Yeah, because that is the first thing so much. So anyway, um, Sekali lagi sudah subscribe terus, uh, <laughs> terus sudah nonton videonya juga terus uh, apa namanya uh, put the comment juga jadi uh, apa namanya uh, kita suka berinteraksi terus dapat uh, respon ada yang positif ada yang negatif but not everybody you know not everybody yeah. likes us so absolutely but we're no we're no gold coins so we like everyone <laughs> exactly so it doesn't matter Um, it's like the, the, the aim, first time that I actually uh, uploaded the video was actually to uh, share our uh, wedding things for the family yeah. but then we realized that people were interesting so jadi ya ada yang suka ada yang enggak intinya kalau kita buat video itu memang cara tujuannya supaya keluarga kita bisa melihat video kita eh kan tahunya banyak yang suka jadi kita lanjut <laughs> yeah, and something else that you just remind me, uh, please, when you're putting the comments, just remember that there are people that are following us that are underage, so be careful what you're writing down, and you can see that it's not really nice, uh, it's not about us, but if it's, you know, offensive or something, we'll try to take it out. Yeah, jadi kalau ada komen yang kata-kata kotor, karena kan setiap video di YouTube itu semuanya bisa baca ya komennya jadi kita menghindari kalau misalnya ada anak kecil atau anak di bawah usia yang baca kan nggak sopan gitu jadi kalau yang ada kata-kata kotornya itu akan kita blok atau kita cut jadi kita filternya itu tapi kalau misalnya cuma ya cuma nyiri cuma jealous or a bye exactly. masih kita oke okay, that's fine that's better <laughs> and thank you so much for all the comments uh, she was getting bored because now she's in maternity leave, so she's kind of like no working for the past month, couple of months actually. Oh, you know. And uh, you're just pregnant, it's different. Um, anyway, so thank you for all the comments. She has been really busy, like the last couple of days have been just full of comments every day and, and literally open the night and just wake up and to see the list of comments. So she is doing all she can. And to reply to all of you guys, uh, and if I say anything in, in, in English and I can reply, I will just do it. But, you did reply one, yeah, just one, but that's it. And yes, I don't feel offended if she calls me or whoever calls me Bule, it doesn't matter. I am Bule, so why should I be feel offended? Yeah, <laughs> jadi, uh, apa namanya, uh, kita benar-benar surprise karena sebenarnya dalam dua hari ini, tiba-tiba uh, subscriber kita membludah. Plus banyak banget komen yang masuk. Uh, terus untungnya pas uh, aku sendiri lagi cuti hamil, jadi bisa balas semua komen-komen kalian. Terus bisa langsung respon. Cuma mungkin kalau misalnya agak lama balasnya uh, beda waktu ya guys. Dan kebetulan dua hari ini aku nggak tahu kenapa uh, aku sendiri uh, ada masalah kurang apa tidurnya tuh nggak nyenyak. Jadi setiap bangun tuh jam empat harus tidur lagi. Tapi abis itu um, tidur siang sih. Guys. And yeah, well, now we are going to the parental class. It's called yeah, it's called that. So basically, it's kind of like teaching us how to be parents, roughly. So we are gonna just see how to prepare for the labor, how to prepare for feeding the baby, changing the baby, these kind of things. Which, to be honest, we need, even if we are getting old, we don't have experience with that. So, um, now that we're getting closer to the date, I'm kind of freaking out. Well, I'm sure we will make it, eventually. Yeah. Uh, okay, four weeks, oh my gosh. Yeah, jadi, um, 
apa namanya kalau ada mis uh, ya jadi buat, buat uh, aku berusaha menjawab menjawab semua komen dan uh, suamiku juga berusaha menjawab komen yang dalam bahasa Inggris gitu kan terus um, sekarang kita lagi on the way menuju rumah sakit untuk ada kelas penyuluhan untuk uh, kehamilan pertama jadi uh, jadi kita sebenarnya udah ikut kelas di Northern Ireland sebelumnya dua kali datang jadi itu uh, biasa penyuluhan jadi orang tua gimana terus kalau misalnya cara-cara emergency kalau misalnya tiba-tiba uh, kontraksi atau gimana nanti suaminya harus harus siaganya seperti apa gitu jadi di sini ada kelas gitu guys dan um, ini sebenarnya tiga kali kita datang cuman karena kita pindahan ke Scotland jadinya ini yang ini yang pertama kali kita datang. Iya. Yeah. So uh, something else about last week. Sorry, I know we the last video we said that we were gonna post uh, last week the uh, picture of the baby. Uh, I'm sorry for that, it's just that we had two kind of emergencies which uh, resulted to be quite nice. Last video that we posted is we were in the hospital. No, she hadn't given birth yet, but we were quite worried because uh, she was bleeding and having some contractions. Uh, so they wanted to keep us in the, in the hospital for you know, checking up. So we stayed the whole night there. And eventually everything was fine. Uh, we went again a couple of days ago because she wasn't able to feel the baby moving. And we had um, a, a heart rate monitor, uh, and we were not able to. Yeah, we were not able to, to hear the baby in start. So we were really, really worried, and we decided to go there. But everything resulted to be fine. So we're so happy now. Uh, it's amazing. Ya jadi di video terakhir kita kan kemarin kita bilang mau kasih foto-foto uh, si baby karena kita uh, ab abis, uh, karena kita akan akan ke for this scan tapi kita uh, postpone kita tunda karena kemarin ada sesuatu di uh, pertama kali aku ada darahan masalah terus uh, rumah sakit tapi ternyata semua fine uh, dan ada mutasi sampai mau lahiran ternyata belum di jangan sampai terus uh, yang kedua kali ke rumah sakit lagi waktu sekitar dua hari no, dua hari ya dua hari yang lalu uh, itu karena sekitar dua tiga jam itu aku nggak ngerasain sebenarnya tuh kram gitu. jadi terus tetapnya alat di rumah untuk ngecek uh, jantung baru jantung si baby uh, dan suamiku yang ngecek ternyata itu di bawah banget kan jantungnya orang kan dua kali terus saya ke rumah sakit and when we arrive in the hospital the midwife say, throw it away! <laughs> yeah, throw it away because it's, it's actually, to be honest, no, but I mean, if I have to be honest, I like it because, it, you know, you can hear the baby's heart and it's quite nice, but at the same time, the fact that we did not hear the baby's heart and the fact that we were not feeling it, we got worried in a really bad way and it was pointless because it was just us that we were not know that we didn't know how to actually use that thing better, like properly. So that's why we didn't feel it. So if you have it at home, just don't get worried if you don't hear the heartbeat of the baby. Uh, just be patient. And as I say, just drink yeah. water, drink something fizzy or, you know, like sugar or something like that so that the baby will move usually. But if the baby is not moving from like the midwife, or the doctor, just, you know, yeah. don't wait too long. Ya, jadi pas kemarin sampai di rumah sakit kata si Gianni uh, bilang katanya jangan punya alat kayak gitu karena sebenarnya nggak boleh karena kita bukan dokter dan bidang dan perawat gitu kan jadi kadang alat itu mungkin nggak pas nggak pas lagi di jantungnya si baby jadi kita nggak ada peran gitu dan punya alat itu uh, bikin tambah panik aja jadi mungkin nggak usah pakai jadi sejak itu ya sudah lah ya jadi kita bisa nunggu kalau bisa nextnya uh, jangan lagi sesuatu yang kayak stimulasi sih ini bergerak kan bisa apa namanya kalau misalnya udah sekitar lama baru telepon sakit nanti kita dikasih arahan untuk sesuatu yang bisa berhasil baru nanti sesuatu yang sakit. By the way, the meantime that we were just talking, I got confused. I go 
another way, so really? it's a bit longer. <laughs> yeah, it's just a bit. Deep, but we got lost, but we are still on the way thanks to Google Maps. I thought you said we were already. <laughs> yeah, have you ever seen this place? No, I don't Neither know. do I. So. I well, yeah, should we pass this? Once? No, maybe we have never been here. Yeah, that's the Sensbury thing. No. No, no absolutely not. Okay, <laughs> we got lost. But we're getting there because thanks to Google Maps, which is leading us there, and we always find a way. Yeah, that's the thing that we're It's saying that the estimation. Well, I'm pregnant. Anyway, guys, uh, really, thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for your engagement. Uh, thank you so much for being so subscribing. And um, uh, if you really want to know how the baby looks, subscribe because soon. How many weeks? Four? No, yeah. no six. six weeks. Six weeks. And the baby should be here. So soon you will be able to see it. See him. <laughs> and see how he looks. And slowly we'll post videos of him, of course. And everything. And uh, at the end of this video, you will see all the pictures uh, that we have from the scan. So we have had two scans, two for these scans actually. One it was like 20 weeks, the baby or something like that and the other one was last week or last week and a half so 32 weeks and you can see all the videos which is so cute yeah jadi jangan lupa ditonton video yang sampai habis karena di di akhir nanti kita kasih foto for this scan kita lihat si baby jadi kita dua kali apa namanya ke private clinic buat 4D buat empat dimensi jadi yang pertama itu waktu usia 18 minggu yang kedua kemarin itu yang penasaran tonton sampai habis jangan lupa like comment and subscribe yeah exactly always like comment and subscribe and last thing we haven't chose yet the name for the baby we are kind of like there but if you want to still give some uh, advices or what would you like uh, mm -hmm. what would you name your, your son if you had it um, just put it in the comments below and we will of course take it in consideration and see yep. maybe we never know <laughs> <laughs> yeah right. jadi boleh dikasih komen kita masih bingung sama nama kemarin uh, di video yang satu sebelumnya udah ada sih yang beberapa masih uh, masukan tapi sekarang harus lebih Okay, so bye bye everyone. Enjoy. Ooh.